this is Kate Schwenke and I have a new video for you guys today featuring the brand new XY Base by Jujubee. I'm super excited to talk about this bag and I'm also going to be doing an on the body video for you guys so you can see how big this bag is on the body as well as a review and packing video so hang in there all the way through to the end of the video to see everything. And before I start my on the body segment, I am 5 foot 2 and 130 pounds. Let's get started. everyone, so this is a review and packing video for the brand new XY Base by Jujubee and I'm really excited about this bag. It is awesome. I love it even more than the Mini B as a diaper bag. I love the Mini B as a backpack for myself a lot of times and even just for quick trips, but this bag is technically a real diaper bag, so I'm really excited about it. It has a lot of awesome compartments and a lot of really great features, so I can't wait to talk to you guys about it. So I actually have this bag packed up for me, my three-year-old, and my three-month-old. I have everything in here that I need for all three of us for probably about a three-hour outing. And I actually have this bag packed up as I have been packing up recently, which is in a simplistic way. So I only have things in here that I need and nothing extra at all. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to first talk about the great new hardware on these bags. You have nice metal hardware. I love the XY right here. That is really cool. And as you may know, this particular line of bags is made for dads, but I love these bags just as much as I love my other GGB bags. I do miss having the prints, but I really like this fabric. It's really cool. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's really nice texture and it is still machine washable and stain resistant and all that. The XY collection has all of the same great features that all the other GGB bags have, but they are more geared towards dads in the style department. To me, other than that, I think that is the only thing that differentiates the two. I think just the actual look of the bags is different. But me as a woman, I have been really enjoying taking this bag out. So it's been really, really comfortable and I just, I really love this particular bag. So that is the cool new hardware on these bags. You also have a few different zippers here on the front. You have one that goes across the top here and that goes about this far down, I guess, or I think that's where my phone is in there, is about this far down. This is your tech pocket. And then you have another secret hidden pocket right here, which I think is awesome. I love keeping my wallet in this pocket because from the front, Nobody can tell that there's even a pocket there, so your wallet and things are real safe in that pocket, and I love that. So on the sides here, you also have one insulated bottle pocket right here, and I'm able to fit a regular like 10 ounce bottle in there, or a nine ounce swell bottle fits really great in there. The 17 ounce does not fit in there. On the back here, you have these great padded straps, and as you can see, you have that great mesh fabric that allows all that extra airflow and it just keeps your back a little cooler. You also have this really cool shape on the top here where it's arched instead of being attached to the top here like the other bags are. So I like that style. I really love the shape of this zipper. I think it is a really, really cool and I love the way it opens. I mean, it's not difficult at all. It's a really easy bag to get in and out of, so I love that. That is pretty much all you have to the outside of the bag. Um, and these straps, I have tested them and they are very, very easy to adjust. So I really like that. And as I am only five foot two, and this adjusts perfectly to my shape in size, and this would definitely fit a man too because the straps can go pretty long. So I really love this. This bag is awesome. So <laughs> that's just a quick overview of the outside of the bag. Now let's go ahead and start the packing portion. So the very first thing I'm going to go over is how I have my Passy Pod hooked up here. As you guys may know, there's no D-rings on the XY Collection bags unless you are using the new clone because that is a messenger style bag. But the other bags don't have D-rings, so you have to kind of get a little crafty <laughs> and figure out how you're going to attach your passy pods. 
And the way I did it with this is I didn't like attaching it to just this top strap here because then it moves all over the place. So I decided to loop it around in both places underneath the strap as well as over the grab handle. That way it was it's not gonna go anywhere and it's not gonna get lost or change positions on me. So that is where I have my passy pod. This is just a passy pod in black and silver that I have had forever, but it actually looks really great with the XY collection, so yay. So in here I just have one passy and I have it on a really cute Ryan and Rose passy clip. So that's all I have in there. Next, over here in the side bottle pocket, I have one cup of water for my son. And this is a really great pocket. I don't know if you guys can see that too well, but it is insulated. It actually goes up a little bit higher past the zipper in here, but I've tried to fit things up in there and it's just kind of difficult. Um, just you can only pretty much fit whatever the length of the zipper is. So this bottle actually fits really great in there. Easy to pull in and out, which is what I really, really love about this style zipper pocket. So there you go, that's all I had in there. On the other side of the bag, there is nothing. You don't have anything on this side as far as bottle pockets go because the way the bottle pockets work on this bag is that whatever you put in there is going to take up space on the inside of the bag. So I like that they only did one bottle pocket on this side because it does take up space inside, but it also keeps the outside more streamlined. So I love that, love, love, love it. So the next thing I wanna go over is this. This is the tech pocket as I mentioned before and it is pretty deep and wide, so I'm able to fit more than just my phone in there. I actually have three things in this pocket. I will go ahead and go over that. I have my phone. This is an iPhone 7, just regular iPhone 7. And next to that, I have my tissue holder. This is a must have wherever I go. I have allergies like year round. So <laughs> this is made by Little E Design on Etsy and I love that. This is in the Admiral print, super cute. Goes with me everywhere, like I said. Um, I also have a small set piece. So as you can see, this pocket actually holds quite a bit. In this small set piece, I just have some things for myself. I have a lip gloss, a folding hairbrush, a little mirror, and I have some blotting wipes. And by the way, that's in the Space Place print, which I thought just looked super cute with the XY collection. If I did not mention it, I'm sorry. This color is called Carbon. <laughs> carbon is a really, really pretty dark charcoal gray, and it's just, it's a really, really great, great color. So that is all that I have in that pocket, but hopefully you guys can see down on my hand here. It goes past my wrist, so that's a really decent sized pocket. Love that. As I talked about before, you have a great hidden pocket right here, and it fills up the entire front part of the bag here, so. I actually don't have too much in here though, but I do like to keep things that I need to grab quickly. So that includes my keys. That is a great place to put your keys. And then I also have my wallet. As I said, this is a great place to put your wallet because like I said, nobody can see that there's an actual zipper here. So there's not a really big chance of somebody stealing your wallet out of here. So this is just a really great pocket though. It's really nice and deep and wide and it's just an awesome pocket. I can't say enough good things about this pocket. <laughs> so moving on, um, that is all that is on the outside of the bag. So let's go ahead and jump onto the inside. So this is what the top of the base looks like. And something I do want to mention is that the top part here is actually kind of firm. Like, like it feels like it could have piping of some kind in there. And so it's a little firmer, which adds the structure to the top of the bag. And I really like that they did that. So let's go ahead and open up the top. Super easy opening. I love it. I love how far down the zippers go too on the bag. So what I'm gonna do is kind of flip this backwards so you guys can see a little bit better. Because I didn't actually fill up a whole ton of space on the top. You could totally fit like a whole be quick on top, I think still. I don't have that much space left over, but like I said guys, I am seriously only packing in a simplistic way these days. I do not like carrying around things I'm not gonna need or might not even possibly need just for looks or something. So I'm only carrying things that I need and this is all I need right now for quick trips out. So let's go ahead and get started. This is that bottle pocket I was telling you about that's on the side here. And as you can see, it comes out a little bit of a ways. There's nothing in there right now, 
Um, so if I push against it, I would have a lot more space, but if you put something in there, this is technically how much space that would take up in the back. So hopefully that gives you guys a good idea. In the back here you have this awesome, awesome pocket. This sleeve here is actually padded, so you could totally fit a small laptop back here. So if you decided not to use this bag as a diaper bag and use it for school instead, you can totally put a laptop back here or your iPad or whatever fits in here that you wanna keep safe that might be tech. That would work really great for that. But for me personally, I am using it as a diaper bag and this comes with a light change pad. So you have a nice thin change pad here and I wanna show you guys the lining on this print. I don't know if anybody else has done that yet, but that's what it looks like. Kind of geometric and I love that color. It's a cool gray tone, so really pretty. But that is the change pad that comes with this bag. Also, along with the change pad, I decided to put my breastfeeding cover. So I have a nursing scarf here by Baby Olay, and this is in the Montauk print. This is a jersey knit scarf, super cozy and comfortable, and this is probably their flattest laying nursing cover, which is why I liked it in this back pocket here. So I just have it folded as flat as it will go, and it fits really great in that pocket. So that goes with me. That is all that I had in this back pocket here. Now you may or may not be able to see in this video, but you have two mesh pockets back here, and I'm only utilizing one of them right now, but sometimes I do put a small set piece back in there too. On the other side here, I have a burp cloth. This is a Tokidoki Baby Olay burp cloth. It's really cute. So that's all that I have back there. You also have two identical mesh pockets down in the front here. And on this side, I have my son's iPhone, so this will keep him busy while we're out and about. And then on the other side here, I have a small set piece. And here I just have some first aid needs and things. So you have band-aids, ointment, nail clippers, an extra chapstick, things like that. So just in case there's a boo-boo while we're out. He's very accident prone, so we get into this more than you would think. But next to that, I also have a hand sanitizer spray by The Honest Company. And in front of these pockets, kind of next to where the bottle pocket was, I have my True Kid Eczema Daily Sunscreen, and we just used this yesterday when I went to the park with the boys, and this is a great sunscreen, but now that we're winding down from summer, I probably won't be including this too much, but because it is still sunny out, <laughs> this goes with us. The only things that I have left in here are a Be Quick and two medium set pieces. So in the very first medium set piece here, this is also in Space Place. And here I just have snacks and things for my son, my three-year-old. He does love his snack, so these have to go with us. Um, and here I just have also a snack for me. I love, love these, these are so good. And I have another granola bar for him. I also have an apple and eve juice. And I have a go-go squeeze. So that's all that I have in there, but those are just some great little snacks that go with us to keep him happy if he does happen to get hungry. So next to that, I have another medium set piece in blackout. And in here, I just have a couple changes of clothes for my son. The most we ever need if we are out for about three or four hours is two sets of clothes because you never know when your kid's gonna have a blowout. But in here I have a really cute little onesie. This is by Love by Hannah and Eli. And I do have a coupon code for them. So if you guys want to get 15% off your purchase, I will leave that in the description below for you. As well as for Finn and Emma, guys, I do have a coupon code for them too. I love coupon codes. This is a really cute onesie too. But um, yeah, that's also for 15% off your purchase. So I have two onesies and then I have a Baby Olay bib. My son is massively drooling now because he is starting to teeth, and we have to have this with us. So all three of those items fit in the medium set piece with some room to spare. And the very last thing to go through is my Be Quick and this is in the Space Place print as well. And in here I just have my diapering necessities. So this is something that would go with me if I decide to leave my bag with my husband. I would just grab this and go to the bathroom with my son. So. In here, I have four size two diapers in here. Or these are size ones. I really need to switch these over to size twos. <laughs> but I have four size one diapers in here, which is usually what we need. Sometimes I go over that, believe it or not. He's very regular. And so I have also a baggie dispenser. These have been so handy for so many different things. So those I highly recommend that you keep in your bag. 
I also have a Y pouch, and this is in the black and white stripes. I love, love, love Y pouch, guys. These are the best wipes cases ever. So I also have a review for this. If you haven't checked it out yet, I will link it right over here for you guys. So that is all that I have in the actual inside part of the Be Quick, but I also have something in the back here for a change. I have a Baby Olay wet bag. This is just one of their small ones, but if there is a small accident, this is a really great place to put anything that's been soiled or that's wet and things like that. So that I just had in the back the zippered pocket of the Be Quick. And guys, that is it. That is the bag and it is an awesome bag. I highly, highly recommend this bag. It is super comfortable to wear and great, great, great for baby wearing. I can't, I can't talk about this bag enough. I love it. So I hope you guys love this video and found the on the body portion helpful as well. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe while you're here. And I would love if you guys would shop GGB with me for the XY collection and all of their other bags too. My link is always active. So if you guys have anything you ever wanna purchase or if there is a big release coming up, I would love if you guys would shop through my link. It really helps support my channel and helps keep me doing what I'm doing. So thanks so much for watching.